Yeah, I, you know, there was a great term coined uh, uh, by an economist, uh, which was the irrational exuberance uh, of our behavior. And I think we're, we're inclined to that as human beings, that, that we really have so much zest for that which is new, that which is different, that w which we often inflate in terms of its value as being more effective, less toxic, lower risk, uh, better return, no longer palliative, now curative. And, and we've conflated all that into these new classes of drugs, which often are as toxic or more toxic in chemotherapy, not necessarily better than in the general population, though like chemo, they may be in selected populations. And, and so it's, I, I think it's just human nature that has led to that, but particularly because when chemo was the only, was the only option, and given its toxicity profile, as many drugs have, um, it just got this bad rap that we need to advance, we need to move on, we, we, we can do better than this. Uh, we don't need these poisons to, to be injecting into our bodies. And, but unfortunately, again, that, that there was that negative that was also exaggerated. And so as many chemotherapy drugs, when delivered appropriately, don't ha carry all that weight. They can be relatively effective in the appropriate population and they may not be terribly toxic.